Perfect. Alright, so uh, I guess I'll just be using the ambient audio here and then uh, higher quality here. Alright, what I'm doing today is I'm going to be doing a bunch of tryouts for uh, Amazon's audiobook website, self publishing. It's called ACX. Uh, this will probably be the first of a series, and so we'll see how it goes. I'll try to get some uh, realistic auditions done. You know, I usually try to make them about a minute long, sometimes two, just to get enough of uh, some characters' voices in there and the feel of uh, the sort of narration the story will require. So, I will start recording here. Start recording. And then you'll be able to see what I'm doing on my screen there as well. Once I get it all video edited together. All right. Yeah, it is sort of. <laughs> all right. So here we are. It is now recording and we are on the ACX website. So I've got here just the basic search results of everything that pops up. You have to be careful. There's scams in here and they never, you know, police anything in any way. So you got to be real careful and not waste your time. So what I'll do is I'll go over here to compensation. Let's just start way high. See if there's anybody who wants something for tons of money. Raptor Cop for 400 to 1,000 per finished hour. It's Th only, I've looked at that before, it's only like a few words though. Like if you look at the, the amount of uh, per finished hour, it's only... Word count is 1,400. Yeah, multi-voice narration with sound effects and background music. Uh, yeah, I don't know if we can provide the multi-voice uh, for a woman that people will want to believe, so, hmm. What, what is the woman's voice all about, and who is she? Let's see here, it says... Do you need a foreign accent, or do you need a character voice? Yeah, that's a good question. Let's see what we got here. Download that audition script and open her up. Let's see what we got. Yeah. Oh, the Willie is pretending to be an old woman? Yes, because... Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Interesting. So it looks like it's just no, a bunch of... customers. See, there's customer one. Yeah, I got SWAT yeah, one. SWAT. Yeah. Stan, Carl, wow, Cal, Stan. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Make it sound staticky. Yeah, wow, that's a. Uh... This is pretty complicated. Yeah, yeah. this is uh, this is a tougher one. Yeah, background customers start screaming. <clears throat> Let's see. Yeah, All right. Get my walk in here. Yeah. Well, I don't want to spend too much time. I never do. I always just look at it, analyze, and say, okay, if I wanted to try out for this, mm, adding in music or anything, I don't know. So I'll just... uh have to do that in post-editing anyway. Yeah. After you just record the lines. Yeah. So where do you find your music? Uh, There's uh, loyalty-free websites. There was one that was advertised on YouTube on an ad, and I just went to it, and uh, oh. it's just royalty-free. And it has the same stuff as uh, other websites who have things that you have to pay for because the people just get paid a lump sum when they're giving it to a website. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then just like people's email addresses, they share the music amongst all the websites and then most of them try to charge you. It's yeah. really dishonest. It's the same with uh, stock photos. Yeah. Yeah. Because I, I, look at, I look at photos. I make uh, flyers and posters and I am always looking at stock stuff. And then, But I've learned how to do... Photoshop and um, word art and all that kind of stuff too. Yeah. Got a lot of self-publishing stuff on our computer. I, I just use a simpler program called Pixlr, which you can use online and or download. Mm -hmm. And uh, it has some of the features of Photoshop. I'm not saying it has the thing like where you can change the uh, level of lighting on a photo with a high enough definition. Or how about go stuff like you erase the background of a photo? Yeah, that's I mean, a pretty basic one, isn't it? Yeah, that's a pretty basic one. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about like 
there's a person who's in shadow and yet you can brighten the image to make them seem more oh, yeah. and then you yeah, can, can rub around the outsides and make it darker still and yet they're mm -hmm. still a little more of a highlighted and it doesn't have that but it, of course you can cut out the background and stuff and pixel it oh that's nice all right he uh, liked, he liked the, the face you know but it was it was a candid and so there was a telephone hanging on the wall and kitchen implements and you just erase that and it, oh it looked, yeah. Then it looks like it was a studio shot. Yeah. 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 Exactly. Sometimes candids turn out so good. I know why people use that uh, erasing thing. Yeah, I don't even know that script. It said it was VO script voiceover. It makes me think that it is an actual already produced. Oops, actually already produced. Uh, like short video okay. episode or something. And then they want new uh, audio lines for everyone or something. That's the impression I was getting. Yeah, already, yeah. When you, especially if you can study the video. Yeah, Then you right. really know what you need to do. And, and uh, loop over. It's called, they need to do the over loop. Yeah, I don't think it's... Uh, My brother uh, does that. Uncle Eric does that. So yeah, yeah. I've never yeah, had any started. opportunity to do that, really. I would so like to get into they, it. They do live. Uh, live filming, the the lines get a little garbled because the ambient noise may, like was too strong in the background, and mm. they get my brother to come in, study the voice, your uncle, yeah, and he can match his his the the sound and the speed of what he's saying exactly to their lips moving. Yeah, and nice. And he said usually it takes a long time, but for a musician it doesn't because you, you go oh the rhythm is. And you're already used to being in a rhythm when you sing, and it's just another kind of song. But to a straight actor, it's a little more complicated. Yeah, that's true. The rhythm musical. of the, mm -hmm. and of course, uh, of course, it would vary in difficulty based on how the people are interacting and doing stuff in the scene as well. Yeah, it's it's wonderful. The technical end of film is, wow. Yeah, even with uh, me just using a digital camera, sometimes the ambient audio isn't the right type of ambient, even though yep. you would think it was for the environment, <coughs> so I have to record it. It just different... doesn't work. <coughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, it looks like this here, uh, they aren't showing the video it comes from. It looks like um, comedy horror. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know. So. Oh, lady, worms just ate the flesh right off her bone. <laughs> I would make a worms just ate the flesh right off our bones. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? Then you gotta have very people screaming. Yeah. <laughs> Triangles of deception. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Let's see, what is this? American urban. Oh, yeah, it's vocal style melodramatic. Yeah, that's what I did. Was <laughs> All right. Was yeah, I'll go real extreme with this then. Well. I don't know, Dart. I have always thought it would come. I am looking for someone that will be able to find the personality in each character of my book and engage the readers. Please read each part of the script, and I need to ensure that your audition will stand out. I uh, quickly edited the uh, typing errors of this person. I don't really They're like it. With typing errors? Usually it's a stolen audio book that they're trying to get made if there's that many typing errors. So, you know, you got to wonder if it's even worth trying out for it or not. They may have had some, an editor clean up their, their favorite yeah, work. Yeah, that's true. And then this is just how they talk. Yeah, that's, that happens too, you yeah. Know, you always, when you self-publish or publish any other way, somebody has to uh, edit and proofread. I used to do proofreading. Yeah, okay, so this is, uh, yeah, this is real dramatic stuff, yeah. Voices. Voices are lovely. Get off me. My head hurts. I can't move. <sighs> yeah. My body feels like it has been hit by a Mack truck. And the voices say, we're losing her. All right. And then we're beeping and it begins to beep faster. Close my eyes. I'm too weak to fight. Just need background music, melodramatic. Music. Yeah, you need some good, you know, cellos or something. Where did we go wrong? I had it. I had the perfect part. The perfect posture. 
I was the perfect wife. I had it all. And there were these two voices going back and forth. 